city of Johannesburg officials are embarking on a tour of buildings in the city with a view of getting rid of hijacked buildings and hijackers following a fire which gutted a building in the city center last week the mmc for transport kenigunene led a delegation of johannesburg city council officials on a tour of a flat in hillpro called vanin court which is widely known as a haven for criminals the mmc said this building is a haven for criminals and also has people that are housed under squalid conditions which are not safe for human residents. The MMC launched a diatribe against non-profit organizations saying many of them were being paid to block the city's move to evict people from hijacked buildings. JMPT must enforce bylaws. EMS has made it clear this building is non-compliant. There is a, a flat here that ca caught, uh, catches fire all the time. The councillor was briefing us. He's got videos. Then some Siri NGO, some NGOs who are making money. The people were telling us some of these NGOs are paid by hijack syndicates on a retainer every month. So they don't care about the safety of our people. They don't care about the lives of people. All that they care is for these people to stay in these unsafe buildings and the criminal syndicates must continue to make money out of the desperation of our people. We are not going to allow it. Uh, I will be guided by you, MMC, but if we shut it down, let's shut it down. Kept under these circumstances. This is what these NGOs are fighting for people to stay okay, under yeah. these conditions. Look, yeah, yeah. And the judges never come here to do an inspection. That is the problem that we are faced with as the city of Johannesburg. Yeah. These NGOs are just happy that man is pouring. They are staying in Santin, driving luxurious cars. And they want people to stay here. Yeah. No. Let's go to the third floor. Yeah.